Earlier the population mode was defined kind of loosely as the peak value of a distribution. We're now going to develop a more careful definition of the population mode. We'll do that by two examples. Consider a random variable x, and this is a discrete random variable, with probability mass function f of x equals 1 half for x equals 0 and 1. So this is a two-point discrete, discrete distribution. There are just two values in the support, and each one of them has a probability mass value of 1 half. So you can think of this as a distribution with a spike here at 0 and another spike here at 1. And the question comes up, what should be the population mode for this distrib distribution? Because each of these are at the same height. So do we define two modes? What do we do? So that's, that's the first example. Here is a second example, the continue ran continuous random variable x with probability density function f of x equals 1 for x values between 0 and 1. So this one is continuous, unlike the first, and it is at height 1. So is there a population mode here? All of this prompts the following definition. If there is only one value x such that f of x is maximized at x, it is the population mode of the distribution. This example right here has two values but not a single value where f of x is maximized, so in this case there is no population mode. Down here you can see we have an infinite number of values where f of x is maximized. Since it is not maximized at one value, the population mode does not exist in this case either.